Perfect pre-race breakfast would be crumpets with Nutella and cut up banana on top and a coffee. One bit of kit I couldn't live without in training would be probably my glasses. I think across riding and running, they're pretty crucial. Um, or I'd probably be a tie with some Beats headphones to get the tunes. I think I've been spending a fair bit of time in isolation, so the music's coming in handy. <laughs> All right, this might sound kind of obvious maybe, but my best tip for the fast transition would be to try and get in off the bike at the front because you're literally giving yourself free time and space. So you've got no one around you to kind of get in your way. You've got a clear run to your bike rack and the best opportunity to get the shoes off and um, running, you know, with free time. You're not chasing out of transition to, to make up time. Perfect recovery day would be a morning surf, then head to my favourite coffee shop, uh, have some food and some coffee, and then up to the horses and a trail ride in the bush. That sounds pretty damn good to me. And some pizza for dinner. <laughs> oh, dear. That is so tough. But I've had my horse for 15 years, so she's got to take the win. She's the original. So horse riding. <laughs> 